This is Sean Seymour with 358 Studios and I am on Maui, Hawaii. I'm gonna take you down here a little bit south and we're gonna talk a little bit about Mala Pier, which is a great dive site. Mala Pier is located on the west shore of Maui in the city of Lahaina and in my opinion, is one of the best shore dives on Maui. During our two and a half week stay, we dove Mala Pier four times and we saw something new and exciting each time. Turtles, eels, frogfish, sharks, uh, boatloads of reef fish. I mean, you name it, it's there. Uh, in my opinion, the really cool thing about Mala is that you don't have to be an expert diver to do this. This is a beginner to intermediate dive and there's almost no current at all. For those of you that like long bottom times, this is the dive for you because it's less than 30 feet deep. We were pulling off hour plus dives every single time we went out and not one second of those dives were we bored. There's always something to see. So let me show you the do's and don'ts, how to get in and out of the water easily, the equipment you need to bring and what to steer clear of so you don't get in trouble with the authorities. Okay, let's take a quick look at the map. You'll notice that there's a right hand side which is north and a left hand side which is south. You cannot go in on the north side or the left hand side. You have to go in on the south side otherwise you end up crossing a boat channel which is a big no-no in Hawaii. One of the best kept secrets of this site is you can actually walk three quarters of the way out before you even have to start swimming and you don't have to walk on rocks. There's actually a sandy path just about two or three feet out from the rocks that will get you almost all the way out there. You'll know when it's time to start swimming. Swim out about 25 feet away from the end of the pier. After you've reached the end, go ahead and drop down and tie off your flag. Please don't tie off on any of the reef. Find something down there that doesn't look like reef or bring a weight. Then get your team together and get ready to start your dive. We chose our drop down point right at the end of the pier and then we swam along the south side of the reef or the structure. Out of there, you'll find something that we call the shark's den, which is filled with a bunch of white tip reef sharks. The locals call them little puppies, but every now and then you'll find out that people have already stirred them up and they'll be out and about swimming around. So you kind of want to keep your eyes open for them, but don't be afraid of them. For you new divers that have never seen a shark before, this may be a little bit more anxious for you and you're going to use more air. Just keep that in mind as you dive. Don't piss these guys off by poking, prodding them. Just enjoy the view. They're beautiful. Next up on the list is our turtle cleaning station. And if you're patient, you don't move around a lot, you can get really close to them. However, they are protected in Hawaii, so make sure you keep your hands off, don't poke and prod, and try not to follow them too long if they seem like they're trying to get away from you because they are air breathing and that stresses them out. If you're just patient, like I was with this guy, I spent a good 25 minutes with this guy before I moved on. They're absolutely beautiful creatures. Moving on from the turtle cleaning station, you're gonna to wanna to make your turn and start to head back. You're looking for a post coming out of the middle of the reef. The reef fish here are very calm. As long as you're calm, you can get lots of cool pictures here. What I love about the way I did this dive is everything is on the right-hand side. You go out on the south, come back on the north. Uh, keep in mind that if there is a current, it's gonna be north to south probably, which will drift you into the reef. So you wanna be careful that you give yourself enough room while you're swimming back. To get to your drop down point and pick up your flag, you're gonna to have to go over the top of the reef. Now start to go ahead and work your way back by swimming along the pier. When it makes sense, take your fins off and start walking. You're looking for that nice little sandy path that we talked about earlier in the video. Follow along the beach and look for those oop owl rocks along the way. Coolest thing about this site, I think, is that you can shower off, dry all your stuff, and get it back into your car without having any sand or any salt water on your gear. Hey, I hope this video was helpful in getting you in and out of the water easily. Also, in what to expect while you're out there diving. My personal opinion, best shore dive in Maui. Make sure that you watch out for the uh, boat channel and you watch out for the boat captains that think for some reason this qualifies as a boat dive. As always, respect Mother Nature, keep your hands off, just watch, and as one of my most favorite artists likes to say, leave only your footprints. Have a great day, and I leave you with this little guy on the reef. Shit, it's raining. <laughs>